Here are today's top tech stories. Coinworks is a fintech firm based in Jakarta and it just saw a 71% increase in net revenue to US $15 million in 2022. However, the company's losses also surged more than fivefold, reaching US $23.5 million per filings with Singapore's ACRA. Gary Tan of Y Combinator highlighted the significance of early stage investing, which aligns with A2D Ventures' focus. In the startup's initial pro phases, the investment landscape is fragmented and democratic, offering nearly equal chances for investors to back potential unicorns. However, as startups mature and their valuations increase, they become more selective, favoring elite VCs, of course. This makes it challenging for VCs not involved in early stages to achieve a high success rate with unicorns compared to major players like A16 and Sequoia. And great news from Singapore, whose Peptobiotics has just raised $6.2 million in Series A funding. South Korea is planning to invest $7 billion by 2027 to enhance its AI chip production. This initiative is part of the country's strategy to support its export-led economy, with semiconductors making up to 20% of its total exports in March, hitting a 21-month high of $11.7 billion. At the Google Next conference in Las Vegas, Google has just unveiled Google Vids. It's an AI-driven video creation tool for the Google Workspace suite. Wow. It's integrating video editing, writing, and production capabilities, enabling users to convert marketing copy or images into really engaging videos. I need to be using this ASAP. But that's not it from Google. They also just revealed Gemini Code Assist. It's an AI-driven coding assistance tool for enterprises. The Cloud Next conference was clearly packed with a lot of announcements. So this launch represents a significant update and rebranding of the earlier Duet AI service introduced in May 2023. Ken Lieber has always had really non-conventional ways of working, and this is a new one too. He says everything is a task, and this approach is proved to be highly valuable while advising a friend on his new business as well. Discussions often reveal that past efforts dismissed due to lack of success involved minimal attempts without proper documentation or iteration, leading to premature rejection of potentially viable strategies. For more on this approach, go read the rest of his article, it's up on our website. And as usual, if you like this video, please make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel, give us a follow on our TikTok account, or you can go read the rest of our articles up on our website. See you tomorrow.